For the first time since being found competent to stand trial, the man accused of killing UW-Madison student Brittany Zimmerman was in court. Zimmerman was found stabbed to death inside her off-campus apartment in 2008. She was 21 years old, studying medical microbiology, and engaged to be married when she was found dead. The search for her killer lasted more than a decade, until David Call, who is a current inmate in the Wisconsin prison system, was charged in March of last year. He'd been a person of interest for years. Today, a judge found enough evidence to move forward with the case against call. Brady Mallory joins us with what was shared in court today. Brady? Well, today's uh, decision means the case will move toward a trial and call may face a judge and jury. Today, attorneys spent most of the hour, more than three hour hearing, looking at the specifics of the case. According to a criminal complaint, call got into 21 year old Zimmerman's downtown apartment that April and killed her. A former police officer who was on the case says he got a report of a man saying someone had shot his girlfriend with a shot Gun. I think it was in the chest area here. There were a number of perforations or in her clothes. It, it seems somewhat consistent with a, with a shotgun blast or, or some type of pellet grounds. Investigators say Call's DNA matches DNA lifted from the crime scene evidence. Investigators say Call approached people that same day to ask for money, allegedly to fix his car, but was actually going to use it for drugs. Former Madison police officer Alan Rickey says Call admitted to being high on cocaine at that time.